Hello, precious angels. Today I am playing Until Dawn. Um, I'm really excited. I don't know a whole lot about it other than that it's spooky and your choices matter and you the point is to not let everyone die. Um, so we're gonna see how how poorly I do at this today. Cool, great. Okay. Tiny butterfly, devastating hurricane. Got it, got it. So I feel like it's telling me something right now. Book of what? I'm shocked. My actions? Mine? Ugh, that is a veiny ass butterfly. That is not cute. Okay, got it. Neato, team. Oh, this is lovely. dangerous. A little dangerous. Oh my god, I can't believe you actually did this. Shh, shh, shh. What'd she do? This is a little bit oh, come on. She deserves it. It is not her fault that she has a huge crush on Mike. Hannah's been making the moves on Oh my her. god. I'm just looking out for It is totally her fault that she has a huge crush on Mike. Ew. Can you believe that? To everyone. Mike is my man. I am I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you that's right, Mike. You're your own man. You control your own destiny. You're the pilot of your own existence. So this place is like pretty dreary. I wonder if Hannah! they- Do they not have any electricity? <laughs> like what's- Okay, we're hiding. We're giggling. Mike? It's Hannah. Hey, Hannah. Steampunk murders, hey, my least favorite thing. Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Josh. Ooh, I'm playing now. Or these passed out friends. That's a. Uh, that's okay. It's a menu of some sort that I just opened. Meat. Okay. Looking around, not seeing a whole lot of stuff right now. They sh they really ought to get some like more electricity in this house. Like, Ooh, shiny glinty objects. Great. God. Ew. What did our naive sister get herself into now? She's got feelings. Leave her alone. Glad you can make it. Hmm. 
maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Wow, that's really enticing. Hell yeah. <laughs> you know, let's start with some She's some making sure. out. What? Oh my god. Matt, what are you doing here? Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, it's all got out of hand, Just but... a stupid prank. Uh, oh, man, you guys are jerks. You know that? Yeah. Take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We just messed around, Beth. It wasn't serious. Y'all are mean. Sharks. Hannah. Hannah. So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Man, things are looking really desperate. Follow footprints. They were deer footprints! Guys, get the fuck out of my way. I'm looking for my sister. I'm trying. <laughs> seems like a weird, unnecessary step. Okay. Neat. That wasn't district. Wow, she had no reaction to that. Huh? This is so. These woods are very spooky. I don't think I've ever been in woods this spooky. As someone who frequents dark woods. the predator. Let's run. This will end well. Stop falling down, Hannah. 
You got us into this mess. God. I generally don't, like, end up on the edge of a cliff with the assumption that I'm about to be murdered, but, um, you know, this that's fine. Well, this snow looks soft. Hold on! Hold on! No. Drop my sister. Did not look that rocky. It was it was pretty um pretty soft looking snow actually down there, but I guess I was wrong. Did I get an oldest? Who's this friend? Before we begin. There are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is you beyond look like a our mole. control. Like a, you a have mole to rat. accept this in order to move mole rat. forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this. As you play your game, every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around <clears throat> you. Cool. So nothing like real life, right? So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, Thanks. Sometimes these things can be a little scary. Even terrifying, oh. but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Oh, thanks, man. That's so nice. <laughs> All right. Okay. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It, it is essential. I feel nothing all the time. In order to get the most out of this experience. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Neither. Uh, the whole situation is making me feel uneasy. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? You! <laughs> nah. Scarecrows are fine. If it's something fine. you can't see, then why does it make you feel uneasy? Because you're terrifying and I don't like your teeth. No. Huh. So, if it's not in the house, then where do you think it is? Can it be in the field? In me. Is this threat real, or is it something in your imagination? Not real. Oh, you seem to possess a very active imagination. Perhaps we can explore your fears a bit. You have a very active face. I don't like it. We've run out of time. Great. Bye. Bye.